so which one of these fractions is greater, one fourth or one tenth? The way to think about this is if you imagine you have one object, you divide it in four pieces, and then you have one object, you divide into 10 pieces. These four pieces, one piece, each one of these four pieces is gonna be a lot larger than each one of these 10 pieces here. That's a good way to think about it. Mathematically, we can figure this out, which one is greater, one fourth or one tenth, and we can even figure out how much greater. So the way to do this is, let's take and multiply four times five. We're gonna get a common denominator here because four times five is 20. And then down here, I can take 10 times two, and that'll get me 20 as well. So what I'm trying to do is get the denominator to be the same, then I'll just compare the numerators. But I can't just multiply the denominator here by five, I need to multiply the numerator by the same thing. It's because five over five, just one. I mean, we're just multiplying by one here. So one times five, that's five. And five twentieths, that's equivalent to one fourth, same value. Down here, let's multiply by two. That's really two over two. One times two is two and two twentieths, same thing as one tenth, same value. Now we can compare the numerators. Five is greater than two, since we have the same denominator. So five twentieths, that's greater than two twentieths. It's greater by five minus two, so three twentieths. Since these are equivalent here and here, one fourth, that's greater than one tenth. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.